today I am going to share with you a very nice uh, Photoshop plugin that works only with Mac and uh, which is called Craft and it is developed by Envision which is basically a prototyping tool. Okay, so uh, today I am going to show you how you can duplicate and replicate content uh, very swiftly by using Craft. Okay, so let's get started. Okay, here I have one blog post ready. Here is the headline. Then I have this one on another line posted on and the date is on another layer okay so these are two separate layers these are two separate layers then there is some lorem ipsum text okay now if you uh, don't know how to download and install uh, this plugin craft plugin you can search uh, craft envision okay so you can see over here you can go to this craft by envision lab and labs and you can uh, you need to enter your email to enable to download it okay so we uh, you are going to enter your email address over here and get it free they will send you an email okay so once you download it and uh, you install it and you restart your Photoshop then you are going to go to window okay and uh, sorry this is our window okay and go to extensions and we have few things like duplicate over here which is also craft plugin then we have this freehand then we have this sync and then we have this type okay so we are more mostly interested in type uh, and duplicate and uh, these photos okay so uh, you will see something like this over here okay so uh, let me show you where is the craft um, manager where it, where it is okay so um, I cannot see it here but normally it uh, it is over here okay so you will see something like craft manager over here okay so then we are going to uh, use it and uh, I have already loaded uh, this one is duplicate over here this one is type and this one is photos okay so I have loaded all these three into one group tabs okay now what we are going to do is I have created a full uh, blog post which is basically containing all the layers and I have grouped them into blog post okay now first we are going to link our layers to with using with type okay so all my text layers I am going to use headline and go to this type headline and maybe beauty okay so like that and then I am going to select this one and this is going to be an article of beauty okay so let's change its width to something like this like that and then this one I am going to link to date ddmmy and this is basically a name so I'm going to names uh, both okay you can see it already changed uh, the name with some random name okay this is really cool this is actual data and uh, this is not lorem ipsum which really sucks okay so now I am what I'm going to do is I am going to replicate this into different content portions okay so i'm going to replicate this and uh, quickly and we are going to use this duplicate over here okay so select this and uh, you can duplicate with a selection and you can duplicate with specific count so i'm going to use specific count and i'm going to use vertical two and this is the distance between every uh, portion of it okay so every copy uh, if I am going to make two copies, I need to have some gutter or distance between them with 50 pixels. So I am going to click duplicate. Now you can see the distance between them is 50 pixels. Now if I click control or command and I click on this, you can see over here. Let's see what we have. Okay, so I think the distance is almost 50. Let's see. Yeah. Okay now let's go back and i'm going to press function f12 key and this is how it went back okay so now there is another way you can duplicate replicate it and uh, i think i lost my connections with these anyhow we are just duplicating it so let's use this selection okay so i'm going to use uh, this 100 pixels difference between two elements and I'm going to select this selection and I am going to duplicate content now you can see over here I just selected one layer 
this one so it duplicated the only this layer so I am going to go back and uh, I'm going to select the whole blog post over here and I'm going to duplicate oh sorry I, I didn't selected any uh, selection over here so I have made the selection and here we go okay now you can see it is going to just duplicate it in the selection other uh, the things outside it it is going to clip them using some mask over here you can see over here okay now these are two functions duplicate content and uh, uh, then we have this type we have covered this okay so you can duplicate with specific count and inside a selection okay now the last extension i'm going to discuss is this photos okay now in this photos you can see you can uh, drop photos from a folder so if you select a folder uh, on your mac okay so it is going to use uh, images from that okay so i currently don't have any images uh, maybe on the desktop okay so i'm not going to show you this one okay so you can select any folder uh, maybe four or five images with four or five images it is going to use them okay and you can click this place for place photos okay also you can use some dropbox link of your photos okay you can also use unsplash which is uh, all the royalty free photos and they have very nice photos over here okay so right now i am going to use let's use uh, category of fashion okay and i i have just used a simple rectangle over here okay so i'm going to click select this one and click place photos okay so it is going to use this as a container and it is going to place photos in here it is going to download from uh, internet so it is going to take some time okay so don't worry about it i think image image looks very big okay so we have one image over here okay so if i want to change it to something else i can change it let's delete this and um, let's do something else okay so i am going to build a few more boxes over here uh, let's do it with two or three boxes okay so i have these three three rectangles okay one square two rectangles and i am going to select all of them let's arrange them first a bit like that looking good okay so like this okay so don't worry about the minimum distortions okay the layers are not aligned perfect but we are learning about this photos over here okay so let's uh, select these flowers okay so i'm going to i have selected all the three layers and i have clicked it, clicked on this this flowers category and i have placed photos so it is going to place photos in all of them okay this is really cool if you have like um, three or four photos or maybe five or ten photos and you are just using uh, simple rectangles uh, when you are designing and then you select all your uh, boxes and rectangles and fill them with the images okay this is really cool this plugin really saves a lot of time and you can use really uh, nice looking photos instantly from unsplash okay um so that was all about craft plugin if you have any questions you can ask me this works only with mac so uh if you are on windows they had some old version but i think they have discarded they are not using it okay so um see you soon in another video